Hey guys, welcome to Beauty From Within. Today I thought I would do my October favorites for you guys. Um, hopefully you guys had a really great Halloween and a great October. Um, so I'm just going to get started. Um, I'm going to start with my hair products. Um, I only have one hair product. Um, and that is my Macadamia Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner. This month I've really been wearing my hair just curly. Um, so I've been trying the Macadamia line, which I'm probably going to put up a review here pretty soon. I just want to use it a lot more. I've used it all through October, but I want to use it more so that I can actually give you a really good review. But this one is the leave-in conditioner, and I love leave-in conditioners. If you guys have curly hair, um, you guys should really try leave-in conditioners. I really encourage it. Um, but yeah, I got this one at drugstore.com, and... I really really have been loving loving this it smells so good and it's such a big bottle and I don't need that much so next um, probably a lotion I've been wearing a lot this month and usually I wear just my cocoa butter but um, I got this Victoria's Secrets Pure Seduction Hydrating Body Lotion it looks like this and I have been loving it it smells so good so girly and the scent is not too strong depending on how much you put on but it's pretty strong that you don't really need a perfume so if you're going out or whatever I've just been wearing this like every single day I absolutely love this and it was just $12 and I got it Victoria's Secret so really love it. this is my favorite scent because I went around Victoria's Secret and I smelled every single perfume and all their lotions and I settled with this lotion and I absolutely loved it next um I have been, before I've bought um, e.l.f. makeup remover wipes, um, like the little eye makeup remover pads, and um, those were a dollar for like 18 but I went, this month I went to Walmart and I found these All May moisturizing um, makeup remover pads, and there's 80 in them, and it costs $5, so I went ahead and bought it because that's definitely a deal compared to e.l.f. Although e.l.f. usually has like really good deals. This time I felt like this one was a lot better. And there's quite a few in there you can see. And I love these. Let me just tell you, um, if you guys are looking for little wipes, um, I really suggest these ones. A lot of pro the thing I like about these, okay, I didn't compare them to e.l.f. because those are the ones I have been using. E.l.f., they're a little dry. Like they're not so moisturizing. Like they don't have a lot of product on them. These have a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of product on every single one. Every single one. There's not one that I've gone to that ha doesn't have a bunch of product. And I really, really like that because with e.l.f. I'd have to use two or three to take off like my mascara and stuff. But this one I only need one front and back and to take off each eye. And you can really use one pad to take off your whole face if you wanted to. Um, but I really, really like this um, because it takes everything off. And they actually have one, I think it's $7 with like 180 pads or something like that, like a bigger one. But this one has lasted me all month and I've used it every single day and sometimes twice a day if I'm like changing my makeup tonight or something like that. But um, I use this every night and I absolutely love this. Love it, love it, love it. I recommend you guys trying it out. Next, I guess, um, we'll go with my brush that I've been loving. This is the e.l.f. Kabuki brush, and it is the mineral Kabuki brush. Um, you can find it at eyesupsface.com. I think it was $5. But at first, I hated this, let me tell you, because it shedded like crazy. When I first took it out, it shed like every single day for like a month. Like it shedded. It just shed and shed and shed. Now it's not shedding so bad. It well actually hasn't shed that much at all. Um, just a little bit here and there. But I really love this to put on my powders. Um, so my face powders and per this month I've been using the e.l.f. Warm Bronzer. And it looks like this. And I've been just mixing all the colors together like this and putting it all on my face as a powder because it actually is 
my color like it actually does turn out to be my color so I've been doing that a lot and using with this brush is really really nice and so I can put on a very light foundation or like my Almay smart shade which is a very light coverage and then just put on a powder over top of that and then I'm good to go and so yeah I really like this it has some like bronzers some bronzers um, a nice blush shade here that could be blush this is a nice highlight shade um, I really like this only three dollars at eyesupspace.com it has a pretty big mirror you can see and this is the warm bronzer but anyways yeah if I mix them all together and put all of my face like a powder like it looks really really good say hi Ofa say hi Nini He's like, what are you doing? Well, me. Okay. Next, I guess we'll go with the eyes. Um, probably a mascara I've been wearing a lot is this CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume Mascara in black brown. Mine's in black brown. Um, most of my mascaras are black brown. Um, but I really like this mascara because it really does give you really good volume. Here's what the brush looks like. I love the brush like I love these kind of brushes they do give you really good volume and I like this because it doesn't take out way too much product where you're just caking stuff on like it does a really good job of putting just enough product on the brush so you don't have to be scraping it off um, so I really really like that but yeah I've been loving this this month to add volume I have it on today it's hard to see through the camera but it looks really really good so if you guys need something that's volumizing I recommend trying this one because I really really like it um, next um, this is the palette that I've been using the most this month it's the elf like beauty eye manual in the natural eye so it looks like this and um, I think I found this like I'm not sure where I found this I found this on the site but it had like the deal where they gave them all like three of them to me or something but here's what it looks like and it does have a mirror right there try to hide it here's what it is all these nice kind of neutral colors and then it has some looks you can try right here um, I really really love this I love the colors and I've really been using this right now all over my eyelid all the way up to my brow bone I just have this color right here which is just this kind of light brown and like it's perfect because I wanted to look very natural today so I really love this I've been wearing this all month perfect for neutralized natural eyes um, I'm personally when these came out I didn't buy any and then they don't sell them that on the site anymore so when I found that deal I was like oh my gosh because I really wanted all of these and especially since they I didn't know that they were gonna stop selling them I thought they would always be on the site no they're not always on the site so yeah I really love these and they're actually some of them are coming back for Christmas so get a hold of these because they're not always gonna be on the site okay next is lips I guess so this is a lip balm I've been using a lot it's beauty rush which is a Victoria's Secrets brand and it's in the color pink sugar like that and it is a lip balm so but it does have a bit of a tint I'm wearing it right now although my lips are pretty pink but um, in the first place but this does have kind of a bit of it has a lot of products first off and look how creamy and nice it is you see my finger mark <laughs> it's very soft and it does have a bit of color just like the tiniest can you see just how it gives me the tiniest tint yeah it smells kind of minty but it but it doesn't feel minty at all so if you don't like the minty tingly but you like the smell a little tiny bit you can you put your nose up to it you can smell it but on your lips you're not going to smell it so it just smells really good and it's just very feels really good on your lips so I've been using this a lot and you guys know I love my Carmex but this has been doing a really good job and I love it next I've really been liking these NYX soft matte lip creams and I bought these at Ulta and this one is in the color Antwerp 
it's just this pretty pink color and it looks like this i'll swatch it for you guys that's it right there it's just this pretty pink color and i've really been liking this it's i really really been liking this a lot of people don't like it because it's kind of drying but you have to put it over top a lip balm like carmex does a really good job or if you want something a little more glossy um trying it with the beauty rush lip balm um or chapstick or you can put this first and then put the chapstick or lip balm or whatever over top of it it works really nice but i wouldn't put it on by itself because it's kind of a little bit drying on my skin i mean on your hand it's really soft obviously but my lips are totally different they're a little dry so but i love these things i'm definitely gonna get more colors like i really like these next is just this elf glossy gloss from the studio line three dollars it's called berry blush and i'll swatch it and it has this nice um brush applicator you see that so here's the color right here it's a really nice gloss it would look really nice over top this um, NYX color but it's just a really nice berry color and I really like them because they're not too sticky they're just very like soft and I really like how these glossy glosses feel I think they're really nice glosses and they're only three dollars so last is probably my favorite nail color nail polish of this month and it's from sinful color professionals and it's called last chance it's just this dark dark green that has kind of like a black undertone and I love sinful color professionals I love them and I love this color I've been loving loving this color um the perfect fall color it's a perfect green color i love green and it's just been my favorite for this month um obviously i've been doing a lot of nail mania videos so i've been kind of changing my nail polish but whenever my nails start chipping i take them off and i put this color on and it's just really gorgeous and i absolutely love it for this month and these are i got this one for 99 cents at a sale but they're usually 199 the sale might be still going on so you can check that out but yeah, those are my October favorites. Um, just a nice and short video. So hopefully you guys are having a great, had a great month and are going to have a great November. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.